I'm Ryan Femling with 3Sharp. Today we'll be discussing refining business data catalog search with scopes. In addition to site collections and people, Microsoft Office SharePoint Server 2007 enables you to search entities and other business data catalog items. The results of these BDC searches can easily be refined with scopes. Here you can see business data catalog related information exposed in a SharePoint list. If we were to search on a term that's related to this, we come back with no information on, from the business data catalog. We will enable this search in the next few steps. Starting in SharePoint Central Administration, go to your shared services provider. In Shared Services Administration, click on Search Settings. In Configure Search Settings, click Content Sources and Crawl Schedules. In Manage Content Sources, click New Content Source. In the Add Content Source screen, give your content source a name and ensure that you select the Business Data Bullet. Scrolling down, we can see that selecting the business data type for the content source has exposed additional options. We now have the option to either crawl the entire business data catalog or select specific applications to be included in this content type. We can also select our crawl schedules. For now, we are just going to start a full content or crawl of this content source after creation. Back in the Manage Content Sources screen, we can see that our application is currently being crawled. From here, we'll go back to Search Settings to define our scope. In the Configuration Search Settings page, we'll scroll down to the Scopes section. Here, we'll click View Scopes. In the View Scopes screen, click New Scope. Here, we'll enter a title for our scope, and notice that you can use the default search results page or you can specify a different page you may have created with a search results web part in it that is tied to this scope. Now we see that our scope has been created but there are no rules for it so we'll click add rules. Here we're going to set our scope rule type to content source and in the drop down we will select the content source that we created. And since we only want BDC results in this scope, we will set it to require that the results come from that content source. We'll see here that our new scope will be ready after the next update, which we can force by going back to search settings. Back again in configure search settings, we scroll down to the soap scope section and click start update now. We can see now that our scope has been updated. So to check and see if our scope has been updated properly, we will click View Scopes. And notice that we now have items in our scope that can be searched. In SharePoint, we'll go to the Search Center. You can see that we've added a tab with an accompanying search results page called Customers. In order to get the Customers tab to show only business data catalog related information, we need to start by editing the page. Now we need to go to the search core results web part and modify it. In the settings for the search core results, we expand miscellaneous and enter the name of our scope. After ensuring that the page has been published, if versioning is enabled, we go back to the Search Center and we try searching for a business data catalog information again. Here we can see that we've got many more results in the search. But to view just the business data catalog and entries, we go over to our Customers tab and that's all we see. 